saw Scarlet. I tried everything. If you'd only met me halfway, even when I came back from London. Oh, I was so glad to see you. I was, Red, but, but you were so nasty. And then when you were sick, and it was all my fault. I hoped against hope that you called for me, but you didn't. I wanted you. I wanted you desperately, but, but I didn't mean you wanted me. It seems we've been at cross purposes, doesn't it? But it's no use now. As long as there was Bonnie, there was a chance we might be happy. I like to think that Bonnie was you, a little girl again, before the war and poverty had done things to you. She was so like you. And I could pet her and spoil her as I wanted to spoil you. But when she went, she took everything. Oh, Red. Red, please don't say that. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for everything. My darling, you're such a child. You think that by saying I'm sorry, all the past can be corrected. Here, take my handkerchief. Never in any crisis of your life have I known you to have a handkerchief. Red, Red, where are you going? I'm going to Charleston, back where I belong. Please, please take me with you. No, I'm through with everything here. I want peace. I want to see if somewhere there isn't something left in life of charm and grace. Do you know what I'm talking about? No. I only know that I love you. That's your misfortune. Frankly, my dear, I don't give a damn. <laughs> I can't let him go. I can't. There must be some way to bring him back. Oh, I can't think about it now. I'll go crazy if I do. I I'll think about it tomorrow. Something you love better than me. The red earth of Tara. 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 Tara.